That's why I fucked your bitch, fat motherfucker. Hey besties, so literally bro, do not mind the forehead, don't mind the edges, don't mind none of that, cause I don't care. Why my best, not even, why my brother was like, I speak to y'all rudely. I'm sorry. I hope y'all don't, I mean y'all know it's love though. January 7th, 4 10 p.m. And I'm on my way with my mom to get a mirror because I already showed y'all how I changed my room color and then it looks cute right now. So yeah, she come in and y'all know nobody know I do YouTube. So we fake got a rush, but <sighs> the past few days have been very rough. I will not tell y'all because please mind that freaking neck. But um, yeah. I, I've been crying so much. Like, I think I cried, like, three times in the past 24 hours. But it's whatever. Real girls take it on the hops. Yeah! Look at him with you smell, you smell like you farted. 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 Eight feet from the broke, I guess you was tired. Watch your haters, boy, no, I can't be no got the brain. Half time, three, all she want to do is bang. Got the hand, though, when the brain's not she ain't. Got the hand, though, when the brain's not she ain't. So now I'm at, at home and I'm just looking for my mirror, but I'm just looking for other stuff now because there's got a couple of cute stuff in here. All right, y'all. So I'm in Target right now, but honestly, I don't know if I'm going to find my mirror because what the heck? And there's mad people here. And like, if you didn't know, Target is right across from my old high school. And one thing I would hate to have somebody from my old high school seeing me like this yeah i'm one of those but now i'm just trying to look for a mirror now and my mom just went to the bathroom yeah i literally had a feeling that wasn't nothing to be in freaking um target so now i'm on my way to yeah tj maxx i don't even know if y'all can see that but i don't know something about looking the way i do when i know there's people around that hardly know me and it's like then it's gonna be like nah you like scanlin and you came back uh what is it called and you fell off e but e e e but i don't care if i fell off for high school bank row ain't fall off oh okay new room who this good morning besties i think this is the first time y'all see me go out in a bun for real for real like try with edges and all it ain't happening again week one be a natural again it, it's giving me middle school vibes so my mom and I are on our way to Brooklyn to go find a freaking mirror because apparently there are no borderless mirrors in the Bronx. I went into at home and co-op. I went into Ashley's Furniture Store. I went into Marshall's. No. TJ Maxx. Target. C&C Department Store. I didn't find nothing. So now we're going to go to Brooklyn and get my mirror. Yeah, y'all don't even know I dug out my license. <laughs> But I haven't driven in actually so long. I'm not driving. I don't trust myself in people's cars. But I got my license. Yeah, I'm seeing a girl right now who I was supposed to fight in middle school. Because she threw a basketball at me. And she was claiming that it was on accident. But she was on the basketball. She was a basketball captain. And she was jacking that it wasn't on purpose. Girl, it was on purpose. You're a freaking liar. Anyways. Anyways, I haven't seen her in that long. That's not the point though. Yeah, I don't drive that much. Like, I don't drive at all. I haven't driven since like April, y'all. It's about to be a year since I've driven. I think this year, I think I'm gonna just start getting rentals and driving. Okay, I'm I'm, I'm literally on two batteries. I'm not even about to soak too much because I gotta go to Brooklyn. Ooh. 
literally i don't know why they told me about ikea because i'm about to start buying for that stuff for that house like i genuinely care about the house oh my gosh i love it here i just got this candle and some water bottles in my mirror and that's all we need for real we got the mirror me yeah, babe now um i'm just on the line waiting for my mother because she's impulsively buying stuff right now like i don't know i don't like going shopping with her she do this too much yeah i got my mirror and i'm so happy you can't even see for real i was gonna spend a hundred something dollars on amazon and I spent $46 in Ikea and I'm not paying my mother for gas. Anyways, yeah, yeah. So I'm really hungry and I'm just waiting for her to get out the bathroom right now. Yeah, it's for my vlog. <laughs> okay, uh, so I'm currently, I just put my bed together. I put the silk sheets on. Yeah. Yeah. Anyways, I just have to steam it because it looks kind of wrinkly. Not kind of, it does look wrinkly. And I'm taking my shoe, I'm taking my clothes out of the trash bags and I'm currently folding while watching Beauty by Wanda. Yeah. Yeah. Anyway, so this is how my closet looks as of right now. I'm just putting this stuff together and organizing it. So I guess you're gonna watch me until my camera dies. right here that he did not collect and I'm still waiting on my gift for Matt but I think I told y'all that Matt's mom literally gave me this cute and I met her once got me this Ugg freaking ear muffins and it is so cute I really can't wait to put this on with my macage I'm about to be going to Baruch like you know what I mean it's so freaking cute yeah yeah but Anyways, so I'm super excited. I think I'm seeing Matt next weekend, aka this weekend, because it's Sunday. But after I finish cleaning up my room for a bit, I'm gonna start doing my criminal justice homework so I could catch up for, because basically I'm done for next week. Like I'm doing like next Friday's assignment, so I could just worry about my macroeconomics homework. Ah, <sighs> you know, let me, let me, let me, let, let me just check my to-do list. <laughs> Um, like I definitely deserve to spoil myself right now. I have been going through the motions, y'all. Like I have literally been going through the motions. I don't even know where my phone is at right now. I'm I'm not trying to find it. Like I don't cut off the whole world and I don't feel bad about it. I'm still cutting off the whole world currently as we speak. I don't know, cause some people just not they're just annoying me. But I lit a candle cause my room smells like freaking new a new house and I don't like that. But um yeah like literally bro i think i told y'all i spent like the whole last two days crying over some ugh. right now i'm cleaning this up because i had this in my um room in albany but now i'm cleaning it up and i'm gonna put it filled with my makeup and hair stuff and like self-care stuff and i'm gonna just have that right over there next to my trash cans don't recommend <sighs> moving back from your out of city college town back home because now you got a bunch of stuff with nothing to do with it so i put some hair stuff in here i put some like skincare health care in here whatever it's tampons shaving contacts like stuff for my um freshener my numbing cream my advil and like um some antibiotics 
Yeah, please don't, please don't mind how much clothes is in my dirty thingy, whatever. I don't even care what y'all think, for real. And look at the, look at the mess of my bed. I'm gonna start showing my book collection. This isn't even a book collection. I would start my book collection. I already ordered another book off of Amazon. The room is coming along so well. Yeah. Oh, y'all can't even see my mood board, but yeah, yeah. Officially my room tour. I had just finished um redecorating my room I want to say like a week and a half ago But I never really got the chance because I was just so bombarded with work assignments and all that So I'm gonna show you guys the details now I just put a clip where you're just looking at it But I wanted to tell you the details the candle is from TJ Maxx and I got it for I think eight dollars So you guys know that I had a drawer before I'll show you guys a drawer right now That was a drawer that was literally here and and so i wouldn't have space here and my whole thing with my room was i wanted more space because my room is actually very small so i took that out instead i put a vanity here and this vanity is from amazon i think it was 200 300 dollars and i just put my makeup stuff in here and as well as my hair so this has all of my blow dryers hot combs curling wands all that then this has, you know, stuff for wigs and just um, some hair products. And then this chair is also from Amazon and I made sure to get it without arms so it could just fit right in and I would have even more space. I have my makeup brushes and if you guys want to see it with the lights on, the vanity, it has three different modes. Please don't mind my freaking PJs, I just woke up. This is with the warm mode. Then this is a bit cooler. And then this is just like studio lighting. So the chair is actually really comfortable. Not as comfortable as my last chair in my dorm, but whatever. Even though the wood chair was actually wooden as well. I just have my stuff for um, cleansing my private area so I don't forget. And then I have my makeup brushes that I just washed. And then I have my old mirror that I used to use in Albany. And this is from Amazon as well. It has its own light as well. And I would just use that when I don't want to use that. So I did tell you guys that I wanted to start book collecting. So I just have my basic books here. I'm missing one because one's in my bag for when I'm on um, my way to school. But here I just keep in my jewelry. And then here I have a closer mirror that I use for when I want to do my makeup. Or um, what I want to put in my contacts which are right there. And I just have a collection of my perfumes. I have the YSL Black Opium, Miss Dior. Um, Eau de Perfume and then I have the Rollerball and then I have my Guess Nor Seductive and then I also wanted to be really resourceful So I made sure to put all my skincare here so I don't have to worry about anything like being misplaced or whatever And then the Amazon vanity came with this box so I put basically all of my makeup in here and I literally love I mean I'm gonna be scrambling for it but I didn't want to carry around that big makeup box anymore the portraits so this portrait was gifted for me for my 17th birthday this is my 17th birthday yeah we love blonde but this was gifted to me from my aunt in dr and so i was just like well i already have one i should at least have two other more so i could just fill the room up with myself so i think this is from canvas prints i think you just have to search up big canvas prints and then i just put a baby picture because i'm like we have to see the evolution of karen and then this is just my favorite picture of all time. Literally, no one understands how much I love this picture. So freaking bad. The thing with the um, cable box is that the drawer used to hold a bunch of stuff. Like, it used to hold all of this, but since I don't have it anymore. And I used to carry all my clothes in there and everything. So I had to get a glass shelf from Home Depot. And 
it's like yeah it's like but it's not gonna fall guys and i just put my controllers here the telephone don't ask why we still have a house line and yeah and then i got made sure to get um the cover-ups for the wires from amazon as well yeah I, everything is from amazon my whole room is amazon so an important thing that my dad did he also painted this dark gray so it could just go with the um color a bit more and i really like the contrast of it and it's just a light gray like it's like it's, it's just so cute and so now we're moving on to the painting my best friend painted it when i got rejected from the ivy league schools and i didn't like my evil eye because it was just facing the mirror and apparently someone told me that's bad luck so i said this goes from my room way more and this mirror is from ikea and it is 46 dollars and i think it is the n-i-s-s-a-n brand I don't know but yeah it's really good so I recommend because it has like these deep and then it's super long like you could see my whole body and my other mirror I think was like from here to here so this whole thing was cut off so I really recommend and it just goes better because I was worried that I would have too much gray which I do anyways now we're gonna move on to the bed so the headboard is from amazon the only thing i wish that i did with the headboard is that i got it a bit bigger but it's like mm, do i really care that much the main thing with the headboard is okay so i'm gonna show you guys right now is because they did not have this they didn't have freaking drawers so i put all of my um jeans or pants in here and then i put my pajamas in the other one like not even that many pajamas but you know what i mean and yeah i think it's really resourceful i learned when i was um redecorating my room that i had to be resourceful because i did not want it to look like i had so much stuff these sheets you guys have been asking me on tiktok these sheets are from amazon and this is a duvet cover set and so you would just have to get the duvet separately that is from target i believe or walmart and then that is from target that I don't know. I just put that to study. I don't know if y'all want to know where the trash can is from. The trash can is from freaking um, Walmart. This is from Amazon. So I just put my underwear in here. Um, I have to wash clothes. Don't even look at that. Um, and then I put some PJs underneath. And then I just put my towel and some sweater and a kimono in here. This is my favorite freaking part. I feel like it's so organized from before. So I keep my hamster in there. That's what it's called, right? My hamster, and that's from Target or Walmart. I think that's from Walmart. And then I get the drawer organizer. And then this drawer organizer has all of my skincare and all that. I showed you guys before and earlier. And I just keep my Crocs in there. And then I had to really be resourceful. I'm going to keep on saying resourceful because I really had to be resourceful. Um, not so much on why my whole closet is black. But, um... So I got these closet organizers from Amazon and they were like 10 or $15 for a two pack. And it was actually really useful for my, I'm talking about these. Um, I'm going to show you guys right now. It was actually really freaking useful because it carries like 10 shirts or tank tops. And you guys know I have a bunch of bodysuits that I don't freaking wear. So it was just really useful. It saved a bunch of space. Like when I tell you, my closet was from all the way over there without those closet organizers. So I keep my shower caddy actually surprisingly from school because it's just a way more organized to put all my stuff for my... Um, skincare my hair care and shower whatever the main thing about this closet is the clear shoe boxes you just go right here and open it and you could already see what shoes you're picking out because it's clear and i just like it. it just looks better like the old shoe boxes don't give anymore and i just have um some designer boxes here that i actually have to throw out but i keep my ysl bags because i don't know where to put them yet and i just have my regular bag and i have some hats up here and then i just have my marnie thing right there these shoe shelves are from home depot and this is wood and this is glass i made sure to get it oval and then i just have some bobblehead that i got at a mets game complimentary and then I just collect my shoes and then my heels. I skip one. One is for shoes, one is for heels, one is for shoes, one is for heels. And I just put a slide up there. But yeah, this is my room tour 2023. And we're doing a transition from good little girl to grown woman. Yeah. I don't even know what I should name this. But thank you so much for watching. Please don't mind my voice. I got sick my first week at Baruch. 
um so yeah thank you so much bye